Good evening, followers and people who just bored. Uh, it's Friday, and we're all back home and decide to actually make some fish. If you remember a few episodes back, we went for fishing on a fishing charter. The fish to be caught all and, the time. And it's only sport fishing allowed. Yes, so there's and no commercial fishing, no money. Well, spent trip, uh, and we actually caught a lot of fish. And today, i just gonna cook uh, two fillets of salmon and two fillets of lake trout. As you can see, it's lake trout. It's more orange salmon, it's more reddish. So that fish was in the lake about what a week ago. Today I'm gonna cook uh, as I usually do. It's like I don't really have recipes, I just stay like and today I felt like I want to go with some mix of the Asian with uh, the like you know rice vinegar, sesame oil, some of the balsamic, honey, and some of the sriracha. So uh, I'm gonna come back and start preparing actual recipe, and you guys are gonna just see it. We're gonna move fish back into the sink because we need to prepare few things before that so we're gonna clean it a little bit and we're gonna use some honey do you have money no no money no honey uh, I know the measurements I just you know go as I do so like I felt like I want that much honey. Some of the sesame oil. And obviously, we're gonna need butter. That's a key component. Always put a lot of butter. No matter what you do, you know, if you do beef, if you do anything, always use the butter. Butter, it's a good thing for you. I know doctors will disagree, but I have my own opinion. In my opinion, butter is good. So now I'm gonna put in microwave uh, for about 30 seconds. And you know, then I'm gonna continue to go on with, you know, my sauce. It's look ugly few components is ready so we got butter and I think it's like you know 87% or something unsalted we put honey and we already add some seasoning oil so we need to mix it pre-mix it get all dirty and I hate it okay then uh, we're gonna add some seasoning seeds it's must, oh my god. Some sesame, sesame, sesame. I think it's enough. Then we're gonna add some of the rice vinegar. Just a splash. No sonic. And guys, don't try to serve the recipe because it's not easy. It, and it might not taste like crap. I had that experience before. And then obviously, I'm gonna put some soy sauce. There you go. Okay, uh, I'm gonna mix it again. So we have some oily, not really good looking stuff. But it's okay. Then I'm gonna add a little bit of ginger. And the ginger always, like especially when you do it finish, you wanna have some Asian taste to it, add some ginger. It's not gonna hurt anything. It's gonna give you a little bit of spice. There you go. Not more than that. Ginger. It's there. Okay, so I have the garlic but today I'm too lazy, so instead of garlic I'm gonna use oops, not onion, obviously. I'm gonna use granulated. I know it's gonna kinda of, you know, defeat the taste, but still it's not Friday. And you wanna do something quick and not really messy. So I'm just adding the powder, now it's powder. And obviously, that's a secret. Sauce for it, sriracha. If you like it, it's too much. If you like more spicy, add more or less spicy, add less, because it will give you some spice to it. So, there you go. That is done. 
And right now, this thing I have a lot of ammo. Let me just squeeze it. There we go. Good enough. Now, mix it again. There we go. It's done. So now I'm going to put a little bit of that sauce separately. And after the fish is ready, I'm just going to glaze it a little bit. So I'm going to split. And now, we got the sauce. Now all we have to do is just put the salmon on the foil paper. And we're good to go. So let me clean it up. We're going to come back to it in a moment. Okay, guys. So uh, we've done this preparation. So I, all I did just grab the foil. Just regular you know, foil you can buy everywhere. I mean, just put a little bit of sauce and especially for people who like to eat skin of the fish that's people like me like i love the skin so just you know, put it like that it's not gonna hurt same stuff over here there you go There we go. We've done this foil, so now we're making our trout. So we're just gonna put like that, and then we're gonna create like a box. I'm going to grab that beautiful freshly cut Lake Michigan trout and we're going to glaze it. There we go. I already can see the interest from people <laughs> because <laughs> even the people who know me, that's the first time they actually seeing something like that. So do I. Okay, we've done with the lake trout, and now we're doing the very same thing with... Ah, uh, rock! <laughs> <laughs> I do every single time it's a new recipe actually sometimes it's a really good recipe the problem is I don't remember them so I guess that's the reason why I'm never gonna be <laughs> working in the restaurant business because <laughs> my clients would kill me one two three four five six seven eight of you fuck off out of here get out <laughs> literally because he would eat, somebody would eat the steak, and yeah, I'm the steak guy. I'm all about the meat. I mean, like, should I used to be like 100% you know, steak man? Until probably five years ago. So I don't know for my, like, I, I kind of like more fish. Okay, so we're done. Now I'm going to go, so you can grab and splash the lemon again. A little bit, not too much, not too much. Now I'm gonna go and zoom it in now. Well, grill is on and we're going to the grill. Yeah, damn it, it's no music here. That sucks. Okay. Here we go. Well, grill, like it's again, people saying the high setting, medium setting. Oh, here we go. <laughs> you want some fish, huh? Don't you? <laughs> so I always put them high because I like to, you know, really preheat the grill and then I, like for fish especially, uh, I 
tune it down. So as of right now, it's about you know 475, which is fine. So I can put fish on the grill, just like that. Don't try this at home, and that's it. So now I'm gonna go pretty much halfway down because otherwise you're just gonna burn the bottom of the fish. I mean, if you don't care, you can bring it up high, and just open frequently. So. And now we're gonna come back. I grab my plate, and all we have to do right now is just move it up around, put it here. all into it so when people say well it takes 15 minutes no it's not I mean it will do this what about 30 to 45 minutes but if you have fish especially Lake Michigan fish you know, just drop it in the grill make some sauce or you don't have to do the sauce you can just put the salt and pepper and go for it, some lime or lemon and thank you again for watching our at this particular moment with that particular episode absolutely useless <laughs> channel but we're still as real as you so click and like and subscribe or unsubscribe and see you next time